Hi March babies, this is your full moon reading for March 2022. So I've already shuffled the cards for us to keep this nice and short. But in the past, in the dying, what's dying or leaving your life at this time is the hanged man. So the hanged man is all about sacrifice or um, new perspectives. He's hanging upside down. He's looking at the world in a different way. And when we do that, we gain perspective, right? of the situation we become a little more enlightened if you will if you can see he has this halo around his head so what is dying and leaving your life is an old belief um that you you discovered no longer resonated with you when you were looking at something from a different perspective okay so that's what's dying an old belief that no longer resonates with you or no longer serves really any purpose in your life in the middle what needs balancing we have this eight of cups so that's very much related to the hanged man. Okay, so whatever belief that you've discovered that no longer re resonates with you to become balanced in your life again, you're gonna have to let it go. You're gonna have to move forward from it. Okay, so you see that this person in this card walking away from all of the cups. That's what we're doing here. You're gonna need to walk away from that old idea, that old belief, if you wanna get balanced. If you wanna stay where you are, out of balance, then hold on to it but it's not gonna help you in the long run. <clears throat> in this position of what's coming into your life is the Knight of Wands. So this could be something or someone coming into your life this time that's very motivating, that's gonna push you to move forward. So it looks like a, a really big change here. This is backwards to you guys, I think. A, little, a really big change here. An old idea that you have looked at and examined that no longer resonates with you, so you're gonna move forward from that idea, and that will create this space for something good to come into your life, something that you're very passionate and motivated about, or someone that will come into your life that will give you a push. It could be somebody you already know. It might not be a brand new person, but their role might change for you. They're gonna push you and motivate you to reach some of those goals that you have set for yourself now that you have a little more space, maybe physically or energetically spiritually uh, in your life by letting go of that old belief. So that is our reading for this full moon. Um, just as a reminder, I do give private readings and private tarot lessons. The first one is always free, so if you connect with me, you can set that up and you can try it out and see if I'm a good teacher or reader for you. Um, and I have some classes coming up, so I'm going to give a Tarot 101 class for absolute beginners on Zoom. If you can't make the time, it's totally fine. I will record the class and send you the link afterwards as soon as it's ready. Um, and that runs for six weeks. And I'm also starting on the Friday closest to the full moon, a Tarot spread class, where I have written, um, made, created Tarot spreads that uh, correlate to all of the stories in the book, Women Who Run With the Wolves. So it will allow you to practice the medicine of that book through tarot reading, which is really exciting. So if you're interested in that, um, let me know. I'll put all of my contact information in the description box below. So I hope you guys have a wonderful moon, full moon, and I will see you at the beginning of April for our April Tea and Tarot. Bye guys.